What's up? This is the Sports Car Enthusiast with another video. Today, we'll be off-roading in some trucks. They're pretty classic, as you can see. I have the Ford F100 here. I have this very old Colden. Yep, so we're ready to roll. This is a V12 swap. It is fast and it is fun to drive. So I'm pretty excited to see how it does in the sand. Mine is a V8 twin turbo. Wow, I just have a lot of speed, but off-roading on the speed will get interesting. See how uh, how well we can do without that. Oh. Couldn't steer away with all the uh, bumps. Whoa. What I realized is this truck doesn't have reverse lights, which is highly surprising. It's a pretty old truck. Yeah, I'm just not... scraping wow, the that, wall. Wow, that Holden looks so good, though. Yeah, it looks amazing. I thought I was going to make it here, but I was just carrying way too much speed. Yep, I'm going to kind of wait for you up here. It's so weird. It's kind of like sliding on snow. You just, you can't stop. Yep, I'm, I'm already sliding in front of you. Very hard to control at high rates of speed. In. Wow. That same hawk got you. Yeah. I think it's time to turn around and head back to me on it. Yep, maybe we'll go through that bridge. Okay, now, yeah. if you guys um, want to see something special, please let us know in the comments. We'd love to hear your ideas. We'd love to hear what you guys want us to do. Um, let us know anything you want from what trucks, from what you want us to do. Uh, dirt, street, type of car, everything. We'd love to hear it. Wow, this is pretty awesome. I never uh, went underneath this before. Awesome. I do also love your drift, guys, so if you guys uh, want to see that, please let me know. We do have a racing setup with a wheel, a shifter, and a clutch, pedals, everything. So if you want to see that, maybe we can work things out and uh, set something up. This truck does not get very good traction, though, guys. I'm superbly amazed. Wow, head on. Wow, crazy. they just. He just got taken out. The traffic in this game really just like hit us. Sliding into you almost. Let's roll. These trucks are very powerful without our engine upgrades. I'm just power sliding everywhere. I don't not even holding the e-brake and I'm sliding everywhere. Yeah, sand and gravel. Oh, wow, almost sliding into the back of you. Let's see how these do on the street. Yeah, that would be interesting. Maybe Let's take a look inside here at the uh, old classic truck. Our speedometer is completely maxed out right now. I have no idea how fast that is. I'm going about 120 in into a three that just fell go. These are very hard to control. Yeah, mo mostly because of the uh, steer. The power. I, I did convert mine to uh, all wheel drive. Also, I'm flying down. Wow. Scraping the guardrail, I'm able to slow it down. Ooh, tricky oh, situation. Side swiping right there. Let's we'll slide this corner. Little tap. Unfortunately. Looks like there's water on the road. Now, when you guys come through water, you always want to shift down at least one, sometimes two, depending on how big the water is. Because you lose speed, and that is the one way to not lose uh, time on your lap. Is to downshift through a puddle. Looks like I'm caught up here in the hills uh, after sliding off the roadway. I'm coming though. This old truck looks very cool. I'm surprised that these trucks are going fast. Yeah, my analysis though is that they're too powerful, for, too powerful for their base. So they've just been having a whack job at turning and steering. Unfortunately, but uh, we'll wait up for you here. Yep, I'm coming up very fast. They are kind of fun to slide, though. Like I said, they do slide on their own without even wanting to slide. That's the only issue. I'd rather have a car that slides when I want it to slide. Looks like you just went the other way, so I'm going to turn to you. Doing some off-roading okay. up. And if you guys would like us to feature more off-roading with the cars, let us know down below in the comments. 
Yeah, we'd love to hear it. Alright, I'm just about to do. Yep, we can see him approaching, guys. We're gonna turn around right here and make it real quick. Just had to avoid that GT350, which we did do a video with. Yep, if you guys want to check that out, uh, the link will be in the, in the description below. Yep. And we do have a Forza Horizon playlist if you guys would like to check out all our videos. But I'm sliding through this turn. Did a pretty good that job. That is a really nice turn. You did a great job of taking that. Wow, another... Wow. Looks like there's a pretty sharp turn coming up, so I'm going to slow down and uh, pull the e-brake and see what happens. Wow. Guys, I tried to get out of that guy's way and it, the car would not move. Highly don't recommend racing one of these. They're uh, old suspension. I don't think cuts out for uh, the speed. They are kind of fun to drift as long as you can get it around the corner without torque shooting it through into the tree. But there you have it, guys. There's our review on some pretty fast old classic trucks, including the F100 and the Holden. Um, let us know. Like, subscribe.